In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for BaNO3 2 plus Na2CrO4. This is barium nitrate, and this is sodium chromate. So the first thing we need to do with these net ionic equations, we need to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. I have two sodium atoms here and just one here. Let's put a two here. Now I have two sodiums. I have two nitrates, but that's okay. I have two nitrates right here. I have a barium here and here, and a chromate on each side. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Now we can write the state for each substance. Nitrates, if you know your solubility rules, nitrates are very soluble. AQ, it's going to dissolve, dissociate into its ions. Sodium compounds, also very soluble. When we get to the chromates, though, chromates in general are not soluble. Barium chromate is slightly, slightly soluble. We say that it's insoluble. So for net ionic equations, this is insoluble. This is going to be a solid because it's not dissolved. These two substances react. This is a precipitate. It's a precipitation reaction. Nitrates and sodium compounds, very soluble. We write AQ. Those are the states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. Barium, group 2 on the periodic table is 2 plus, And the whole nitrate ion is 1 minus. Good one to remember. We have Ba2 plus. I won't write the states right now. Let's do that at the end. Plus, we have two of these nitrate ions here. So two of the nitrate ions. Sodium group 1 is 1 plus, And the chromate ion, CrO4, is 2 minus. And you either memorize that, or you're allowed to look it up on a table. Check with your teacher. So we have two sodium ions. And then we'll have just the one chromate ion here, Cr. O4, 2 minus. So these are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we don't split solids up when we do net ionic equations. So we're just going to call this barium chromate. Keep it all together here. And then we have the sodium and the nitrate. So two sodium ions. That's that Na plus. And put it down here, two nitrate ions as well. So this is what we call the complete ionic equation. And now we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of that complete ionic equation. So we're looking for things that are the same in the reactants and the products. I see that we have two nitrates here in the reactants and in the products. So those are spectator ions. We can cross those out. We have two sodium ions here in the reactants and in the products. Spectator ions, cross them out. What's left is the net ionic equation for BaNO3 2 plus Na2 CrO4. I'll clean this up and write the states in. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for barium nitrate plus sodium chromate. If you look at charge, you'll see that charge is conserved. We have a 2 plus and a 2 minus. That balances out, gives us a net charge of 0. This is a neutral compound, so the net charge is zero here. And if you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the net ionic equation for BaNO3 2 plus Na2CrO4. Thanks for watching.